Welcome back. Rising food costs are putting people in a little bit of a bind this year. This all happening just 72 hours away from Thanksgiving. Fox 44's Rachel Riley explains. If you are balling on a budget, this year's Thanksgiving dinner might be a little more challenging because of rising food costs. This is the highest I've paid ever. It's two fifty-seven. dollars Makes you kind of wonder, maybe I need to just rethink my, my menu. Shoppers like Lisa Christiana and Janet Hochstrom do their annual holiday scour to find the best for Thanksgiving dinner at places like Calandro Supermarket. For Thanksgiving, along with a couple of days before Christmas, are our biggest days of the year. However, some are feasting their eyes on higher prices everywhere instead. One of my favorite things to do is to cook for family and friends, and, and that's kind of been cost prohibitive. I think meat is the highest thing that has gone up, and the thing that I, I just don't buy much. We're looking at 40 to 60 percent increases on cost for turkeys. Department of Agriculture Commissioner Mike String says prices are creeping up to record highs. Thanksgiving is about 14 percent more expensive than last year. Overall food inflation for meats, that's meat, poultry, fish, is up 19%. $56 for a quart of oysters that expired a bar. So I'm going to go home and Google how to make mock oysters. Wish me luck. But what happens is that we've been through COVID. We've had labor issues, supply chain issues, production issues, transportation issues. So there are many factors that are, are involved when you get that final price. To find out ways how you can keep your Thanksgiving dinner affordable, you go to BeOurProud.com. From Calandro's Rachel Riley, Fox 44 News. All right, thanks, Rachel. Now, Commissioner Strain says don't wait until Wednesday to get your shopping done. It's already Monday, so the sooner the better. Coming up, Coach O. <laughs>